Welcome to my video. All right, so we are in Horror Hound right now. We're gonna interview some celebrities, and it's gonna be so much fun. So let's do this. Come on. So we are walking the floor. I am going the wrong way. It's time for another on the spot. On the spot. What is the TV show most people can't stand, but is your guilty pleasure to watch? We'll start with you. Oh boy, um, like soap operas. You love soap operas. You're a big Days of Our Lives guy from uh, way yeah, back Luke in the day. And Laura. Luke and Laura. Is that General, General Hospital? Hospital? Yeah, yeah, big yeah General when they Hospital. got when they got married. Yeah, you probably don't even remember soap operas. Do they still have soap operas? Is that a thing? Yeah. Online. General Hospital. Okay. I still like watching like Knight Rider when it comes on. You know, it's really not a good show, but there's something that's you know. Oh, it's no, you wouldn't remember. It's a car. The guy had a talking car, fast race car, and there was a voice. It had a voice. You know, this was the '80s. You know. I know I'm on my way. Hang on. That sounds so cool. Yeah. I have to check that out. We're Unless I'm too it. young. We're reboot yeah. Night Rider. I enjoy the Transformers. When my nephew comes over, we watch the Transformers. Bumblebee. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my kids watch uh, Adventures of Gumball. You ever watch that? Oh, Amazing World of Gumball. Amazing World of Gumball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, like that's actually yeah. a very funny show. Yeah. What's the one with the pizza slice that talks? Uh, I can't remember what that was. Uncle Burrito? Uncle Burrito or something like that? Is there an Uncle Burrito? Uh, Uncle Grandpa? Uncle Grandpa. I think that's what it is. Uncle Grandpa, yeah. If you could go anywhere to any time, would you rather spend a week in the future or a week in the past? Definitely a week in the past. I, I love history, and I love to go back in time and see what it was like around the, in the 1800s. Yeah, we're both history guys, so we definitely like to go back to the past. Uh, even something like... Uh, I don't know, like the 50s or 60s. I'd love to be, you know, I mean, I was born in the 60s, but love to have been an adult, like, in the 60s during, like, the music scene and the, uh, you know, the revolution. Uh, you know what I'm talking about? I do, yeah. yeah. I don't know what you guys talking about. The but British I Revolution. Oh, history. I still need to learn what that, about that stuff. Study your history, people. If you could guest star on any current TV show, which one would you choose and why? If I could be on any sh sh current show? Uh, I would like to be on Game of Thrones because that's my favorite show on television. Wouldn't you die or would you think no you would way. live? They wouldn't be able to kill me. I'm too, I'd be too fast and too strong for them. <laughs> what about you? The White you? Walkers would be coming for me and I would just be running. They couldn't catch me. What about you? Um, my favorite comedy on TV right now is called Catastrophe. It's on Amazon. So I think it would be really fun to be in that show. Otherwise, man, there's a lot of shows I'd like to be on. Uh, 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 I think like a good hour-long, uh, uh, like a good, yeah, a good historical period piece, like one of those Band of Brothers kinds of things, you know, military. What about Peaky Blinders? I like to be on yeah, something like yeah. a Peaky, Peaky Blinders. Blinders be an Irish gang member. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you could have breakfast with any historical figure, who would it be and why? Historical figure and why? Um, has to be breakfast. Just breakfast. I mean, yeah, you can go out for Starbucks, coffee. You, you can go to anywhere yeah, yeah, if you wanted yeah, sure, to. Sure, sure, sure. Anybody, or would it have to be someone that's already like in the past? Historical figure. Historical, historical figure. Dead. Like, a, like a Leonardo da Vinci. You know, I'd like to have breakfast with Leonardo da Vinci. You guys talk about like art. Talk about art. Talk about inventions. I mean, he did a lot of stuff. He created flying machines. Yeah. So he has a lot to code. talk about. Right. The code, the special code. code. Yeah. Uh, I would like to maybe have uh, Huevos Rancheros with Socrates to see if the Huevos Rancheros really existed sure. in front of us. Like, or if it was yeah, not really there. Are yeah. they really there or are they not really there? Existential breakfast with Socrates? Yeah. Socrates! I can only think of presidents. How about yourself? For... Who would you like to have if you could have uh, mm. breakfast with anybody? What would you first eat and who would it be with? I would... What I would want to eat. Yeah. yeah What's, your What's your favorite pancake item? What's your favorite I would be, be uh, like 10 mini pancakes mm, well, with nothing, nothing on it because I'm a weirdo. Dry pancakes? Like dry silver dollar pancakes? Sure, why not? Okay. I mean, I, okay. I'm, a weir I'm a weirdo. Probably say like Abe Lincoln or something. Right. Cool. Not like one of those big guys like Taft or Grover Cleveland. Those guys were big. They'd eat all your pancakes. You wouldn't have any left. So Honest yeah. Dave. 
he wouldn't eat your pancakes, would he? No, nope, he'd be too honest. And if he did, he'd tell he'd the truth to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, nice the president tells the truth. He, he would be like, I'm sorry, Retro, I ate your pancakes. I was just so hungry. He's a good man. He's a good man. I think that's it. We had so much fun together. I'll see you guys in the next video. Smash that subscribe button. And goodbye.